All right, you guys, let's take a look how to transform objects into wireframes here in Blender real quick. So first I'm gonna go and create a torus. I'm gonna select the torus, for example. And all I need to do is go here to the modifier, add modifier and search for wireframe. Enter, and this is going to transform the torus into wireframes. And here at the thickness, you can increase or decrease, but I'm gonna go all the way down. I'm gonna go probably with 0.003. So it's gonna go really nice and thin. And as you can see, both sides are going to be visible. So basically that's why it's transparent. You also can go and zoom in. And for example, here you got the offset. So this is going to offset internally in the center or externally. So I'm gonna go with max. And then you also get like some other options, which I don't even know. So this is going to fill it. And then you got like other stuff as well. So anyways, right now I cannot increase or decrease the wireframes, but I can go to add modifier, search for subdivision modifier, enter. And here I'm gonna need to bring this above the wireframes. So it's going to make it more dense. So right now it looks something like this. And the better thing to do is fill up the interior. So only one part is going to be visible instead of both. Because right now you can see the wireframe looks really confusing when you see everything transparent. So what I'm going to do is select the torus, press Ctrl C, Ctrl V. And now we've got a new copy. And I'm going to select the bottom one. And here I'm going to go and delete the wireframe. Click on the X. All right, so I'm going to need to change up the renderer. I'm going to go with this one. And let's go to the material, add a new material and click on the surface and you can go and add an emission. I'm going to change this up to black and take a look at that. Now it looks really cool. I'm going to select the first doors here. I'm also going to go and add, change the surface, switch it to emission, deselect. And now it looks something like this. So pretty much that's it. And thanks for watching.